Hey guys, so today I was going to touch on something that I don't think is well known, which is how to install Microsoft Office on Ubuntu. Now, the thing about Microsoft Office is the native application, I mean, without emulation like Wine or something like that, it just doesn't install correctly. So <clears throat> I wouldn't waste your time with that. But in the business world now where everything is really cloud-based and we're really moving towards uh, virtualized applications in the cloud or access to applications that are on a web page, um, this makes using Ubuntu and Microsoft Office possible. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, install Microsoft Office apps and how to install Microsoft Teams which basically will give you the suite of Office on Ubuntu. Okay, so let's start with opening the terminal. And in the terminal, the first thing we're gonna do is let's install Microsoft Teams. So to do that, it's just sudo snap install teams for Linux. Put our credentials in. Wait a couple seconds here, and Teams is installed. Um, and we could tell that because we could see Teams for Linux right here. Now if we dip back into the system here, and we want to install Microsoft Office. Now here's the fun thing, is technically Microsoft Office can't be installed, but the Microsoft Office web apps can be installed because the Linux operating system is very close to your Android-based devices or even your iPhone-based devices, which are all really Linux kernel or Unix kernel based. So how do we install Microsoft Office like we would install um, something on you know, your phone or your uh, tablet or some, something to that effect? And specifically, Microsoft Office 365 apps. So to do this, what we're going to do is we're going to actually just type in sudo snap install unofficial because frankly Microsoft's not going to develop office applications for Linux because that would be conflict of interest they would be competing with themselves uh, web app fork and hit enter and what this is going to do is this is going to install the application fork for our Linux system from the snap installer which doesn't take very long, but it will give you the experience of running everything local. And to that, we'll hit the uh, Show Applications button again. And now we can see Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Outlook, OneNote, Microsoft OneDrive, Teams, Excel, which is basically your suite of Microsoft Office apps. And I'm here to tell you that this works really well. Um, this gives you the experience as if you were running it on your phone, on your Linux-based system. And there's, with this experience and with this configuration, there's really no reason to buy the business premium apps. You could get away with the cheaper one because it'll publish the apps and allow you to use them based off of the cheaper uh, license configuration that you find on your uh, Microsoft billing. Um, I would suggest you try it out. Give it a shot. Let me know what you think in the comments, but I think it works really well. And... Um, if you're a business and you're looking to save money and not have to upgrade all your machines to Windows 11, you don't have to go through any compliance st stuff and you just want a machine that's reliable and you use the Office application, the uh, Office 365 apps, this is a great alternative to purchasing a new machine. Again, uh, like and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think and definitely let me know how this works out for you. If any problems or um, if you used it in the past and you don't like it, I, I would like to know. All right, take care, guys.